36-year-old veteran Mark Melanson, he finds a new home with the San Diego Padres and the particulars of the deal haven't been coming out yet, but he agrees to go to San Diego and this San Diego team, what an offseason it's been for them getting Blake Snell, you Darvish, they're just making moves left and right, they're stacked at the rotation, they got great hitters obviously, Fernando Tatis Jr., Manny Machado, Eric Hosmer, you just name it, there's a loaded team, and now you're adding Mark Melanson, a guy who's been solid throughout his career in the back end of bullpens. He's bounced around, obviously, the majors, but he's reliable. This will be his 13th season in the bigs, and it's a good move here for San Diego. And Melanson, he's probably going to compete for the closer role here in spring training, and I'm surprised he lasted this long on the free agent market was Melanson, and I'm assuming this deal's only going to be one or two years, so it's a great move for the Padres. The veteran Melanson, he gets on another team in the last few seasons. Let's take a look at some stats here for Melanson. 2019, between the San Francisco Giants and the Atlanta Braves, he was 5-2 and two with a 36.61 ERA, 67 innings, 68 strikeouts for Melanson that year, and he also had... That season, 12 saves and a whip of 1.590 was Melanson. And then 2020 last season, 2-1 with a 2.78 ERA, 11 saves, 22 winnings, 14 strikeouts, a 1.279 whip. So Melanson, he still has the closer mentality. He still could close games out. And I think he's going to be the man to start the season over here as the closer for the San Diego Padres. I don't think they're going to go with a youngster or anything of that. And on the season, the projections from Atlanton, 4-3 with a 4.06 ERA. Only nine saves they're giving them with a 1.387 whip and 58 strikeouts. So Mark Melanson, it's a good landing spot. The Padres, they're going to be one of the better teams in the major leagues this season. I think they're the third or fourth Best team overall so far in the majors behind the Dodgers. The Yankees, I think, ahead of them. And maybe Houston. But anyway, Melanson for fantasy baseball. He's a player you take anywhere from the 10th to the 15th round. Especially if he's going to be the closer. Like I said, he's going to be on a good team that's going to score a lot of runs. And get a lot of wins this season. Unless injuries or something else pops up. So Mark Melanson... It'll be a good close, and I think it could be a top 10 to 15 closer in fantasy baseball this season if he becomes the closer. So Mark Melanson signs a deal with the San Diego Padres, and we'll see what he could do for the Padres and if he's the close and have fantasy value this season in the upcoming 2021 season.